this is my delicious pork and apple burgers. You'll absolutely love it. So I want to make something different for the burger. So I decided to use pork. I decided to use some lovely apples, sage and garlic. Absolutely easy to make, simple and very, very delicious. So I've got this beautiful quality pork mince from Lidl. As you can tell, there's a beautiful layer of fat through it and it's a beautiful looking color. And to that, I'm going to add some lovely chopped sage. So I'm using classic flavors here like pork, apple, sage and garlic. And it's something different because we always eat sort of steak burgers all the time. It's quite nice to, you know, use something different. And this recipe works great as well with, uh, with beef mince. Would be no bother at all as well using that. So sage, my lovely garlic. This is a great one for the kids. A great family favorite, I have to say. Kids will love it. And it's homemade as well. And it's quite good, like when we're molding the burgers, you get the kids up as well, they help, which is quite good. So a nice bit of garlic to that. So to this, I've got a lovely apple. Best way to do the apple. Don't worry about the, the core and just grate it. Our lovely mince. Give it a good mix. I'm going to add a little bit of salt. Nice bit of pepper. So now I'm going to add lots of parsley. Like so. And it's a great one now for the kids. You can have the kids up help and they can mix it all together. And if you want it, instead of doing burgers, you can make them into little pork meatballs as well. So, so it is a great recipe for doing different things. Crack an egg, great way to crack an egg. Off the side, like so. And my lovely breadcrumbs. So at this stage, as I said, get the, get the kids up, get the hands in there. And how simple is that? Just to make a simple homemade burger. And as I said, I'm using pork. I want to use something different. So we're going to get four burgers out of this. And the best way is just to get your mix like so. So now just divide it into four. So obviously in a chef world, if we're, in, if we're in a professional kitchen, you would get your weighing scales out and you would weigh 120 grams, but we're not cooking in a professional kitchen. Best way to do them, we'll roll in this sort of like a, a cricket ball size and just just shape them like so. And as I said, it's fun. You'll have the wee man up. You can make us in the meatballs as well, which is quite good. But look how easy that is to make. So I'm going to put these into the fridge for 10 minutes to firm up. And you can also put them into the freezer. When they're frozen, they can keep them for a couple of months. They're absolutely great. So I'm just going to let them set in the fridge for about 10 minutes. So I've got my burgers out of the fridge. They're just nicely firmed up. So I'm just going to grill them for about 10 minutes. And a little tip now to, to finish the salad is kind of wait the last minute just so the salad keeps really, really fresh. So here I've got some lovely rocket, a lovely bit of lemon and some beautiful fennel. And fennel is absolutely delicious in salad. And the best way to do fennel is take off this little bit of the core and just basically cut it in half and thinly slice it as fine as you can. And it's a great way, like obviously you can cook fennel, make any purees, etc. But try it like it's thinly, thinly sliced with some lemon juice and salt. And I have to say, it's absolutely beautiful. Look at the quality of that fennel, it's just so fresh. Look at that. Well, a little touch of salt. Like so. So got some lovely rocket. A nice mix. 
some lovely lemon juice. And the whole thing about the lemon just brings a whole lot together. The aniseed of the fennel, the peppery of the rocket. Look at that. Do a nice little mix. So I'm just going to check my burgers. So burgers are beautifully coloured. Look at that, absolutely delicious looking. So I'm about to plate up, so I've got some lovely toasted buns. And for me, this is a great one for, for the family. So I've got my lovely little burger. And they make it very, very simple. I've just basically got some lovely homemade oven chips from Lidl that I've just simply just put into the oven. I've just cooked them for about 25 minutes, finished them off with a little bit of sea salt, like so. I've got my lovely rocket and my fennel. I make sure everyone gets a nice bit of fennel on it. Look at that. And they will absolutely love it. My little... Let's do two. I'm hungry. I'm starving. Let's do two. So a nice little one. My lovely burger. Nice bit of fennel. You'll love, you'll love this. The fennel with a rocket. A little bit of lemon juice. Look at that. So there we go. That is my beautiful pork and apple burgers with a lovely fennel and rocket salad and little handy chips from Lidl. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.